Hey, Empress. Hey, Empresses. How are y'all doing today? This video is going to be for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. If you are new here, welcome. Thank you so much for joining. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. It helps grow the channel. Let's begin. Angels, ancestors, spirit guides of the highest white light, please come down and protect me. Please come down and give me clear messages straight from the divine. Archangel Michael, OG, please come down and protect me as I channel this different energy, please and thank you. And please come down and cover the viewers that have clicked on this video today. And again, yeah, I'm sending out an abundance of peace, love, and light always. What are the messages today for Aries? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. So Aries, you have someone new that's coming into your life. You have a new person that you're getting ready to meet. Someone new. Someone new is coming. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, and this person, they actually do know how to behave. <laughs> this person actually knows how to treat you right. Someone here has their acts together. You could have been dealing with someone here that could have been a clone of this new person, or you could have been connecting to someone that likes to deal with clones of you, likes to deal with copycats of you, okay? And this person's getting karma for generations now, okay? Yeah, this, per this person, this clone has bigger fish to fry than, than worrying about what's going on with you, okay? They have, they have, they have, they have people watching them, okay? Yeah, someone here has karma for generations, yeah. They wanted you to believe something. They wanted you to believe in something, okay? But yeah, you don't owe this person anything. This is someone here that walks around like they have a chip on their shoulders or they, ooh, it could have been something about a business idea or you're being led to trust a business idea, but something about how this person walks around with a chip on their shoulders, walks around like they're better than. They could even have been feeling like they were better than you in different ways. Ooh, two, 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 as I said, that's horrible. Hmm. Can't make it up. Made you feel less than. Be mindful. There's someone here that is, <clears throat> they don't want me to say this. They could be going to pay for things to be done to you. Yeah, this is someone that's jealous of you. Someone here is, is paying for work to be done on you. You could definitely be praying more. You could even be feeling, you know, for, for some of you guys, you could be feeling more tired. This could even be like headaches, nausea. Someone here is, is jealous because you have heavy influence in this world. You could be an influencer in some way, shape, or form. This person is trying to think of a master plan as well. You could be connected to a musician or you could be a musician. Tell me about this, um, tell me about this jealous. Who's this person that's jealous of Aries? <clears throat> Who's this person that's, ooh. Someone here wants, hmm. They, ooh, they, ooh, they want to be your match. Or they feel like they could come up against you, but they can't. Your ancestors are after them. Someone here wants, yeah, this is someone here. I cannot make it up. This person literally is paying for work to be done. Three, four, five on the clock. This person that's jealous of you. They could be under heavy drugs and alcohol. It's time for you to burn sage. It's time for you to sage your atmosphere, sage your environment, sage yourself, take spiritual baths. You could be using crystals, incense, okay? Because somebody has been gone. They're, they're lost. They're like a lost soul now, which is why they're resorting to doing things of low vibrational work, working with the other side, the dark side, okay? This person can have gifts or they're realizing that you are a gift, which is why you're not affected. What's this thinking of a master plan? Yeah, you, you could be taking screenshots of things or someone here is taking screenshots of you because you're sunlight. They're trying to figure out, yeah, how to how to wage war, some type of war with you. Tell me about this influencer. This person is destroying themselves. You could be an influencer. It could be a karmic Libra or a Gemini. Someone here is, is you know, they, they are acting one way, but they could be acting a different way behind your back. It could be a Libra that's doing this or a Gemini, okay? I'm seeing here. 
and you have some type of influence, yeah, this person's up at night because they're thinking about you. They're losing their mind because they're realizing that you are enough, Aries. They're realizing that you are enough. Tell me more for Aries. Aries, you have alchemy. You are able to transmute pain, pain into love, into blessings, into, ooh, into miracles. You're about to level up with the gifts that God has instilled in you. You're using it. You're using your gifts at this time. You're leveling up in your life. You have a major level up that's coming in. You have a major level up that's getting ready to come towards you. I hope you are ready for it. It could be something about Egypt. Queen Nefertiti is here. Queen Yah. Asintawa. Sorry. <laughs> but you're worthy. You're worthy. I don't know how to say these names, but these are these are queens. Okay, you are very worthy. Yeah, you bring a storm. Ooh, your energy is strong. Ooh, buddy. There's someone that was trying to bring you a storm. Okay, but they don't know that you control it. They don't know how powerful you are. That's why you're getting ready to reap your harvest. You went through some type of radical rebirth where you were able to transmute pain. Okay, yeah. And now you have nothing but good karma coming around you, Aries. You are very blessed. Somebody here was trying to betray you. Seven of Swords. They were trying to get away with different things. Okay, this could have been a, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or an Earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. King of Pentacles. That's the truth. You got some type of clarity as well. And now you're winning. Now you're in a place of success. Six, five, four on the clock, as I'm saying, it's accolades, blessings, rewards. Okay. You're in a place of, of high recognition, high honor. It's all about you. Woo! It's all about you. It's all about you, Aries. The Wheel of Fortune, it's all about you. God is saying, what do you want? It's your time to shine. What's, what, what do you want? What path you want to choose? What blessing you want to unlock? What door you want to unlock now? It's like, <laughs> you're getting blessed. This is, this, this is blessings. It's because of some type of test. Okay, the Wheel of Fortune is about fated events, things that we cannot control, things that happen, things that God is in control over, us surrendering to God's plan over our life. This is the Wheel of Fortune. This is like the birth chart. That's why it's like words written on it. It's also Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, Leo energy. Any of these signs can be significant to you as well. But it's all about choices being made, fated events, things taking place that are out of our control, but letting, just understanding that we have, you have faith in God, understanding that things are going to work out for the betterment of you. There was some type of choice that you made, okay? And, and, and it, yeah, it brought you to a, a divine path. Now you have someone that's coming in because they're looking at you as the one, queen of pentacles, a boss, a blessing, you could be a business owner, you could be a CEO, you could be very resourceful, very patient, very blessed, you could live a very luxurious, happy, fulfilling life, okay? You're, you're a nurturer, you're a provider, you could be a caregiver, very loving energy, okay? You give, you, could, you give the shirt off your back to others. You're very focused on your security and on your stability at this time, and somebody here wants to come towards you, male or female, because again, you are winning. Woo, you a winner. Winner, winner, winner. <laughs> what am I hearing? Winner, 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 chicken dinner. Where is that from? Y'all put it in the comments for me. What is that? Winner, 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 chicken dinner. <laughs> what? Y'all may like a chicken dinner. Y'all may be going out to eat and it could be chicken for, that you're having for dinner. You could be winning a prize. But you have someone here that's coming towards you because they look at you as a prize. Six of Wands. The Knight of Cups to the Six of Wands. Wow. So who's this guy? Yes, look at this. The Two of Cups. Someone is coming towards you. Who is? Yeah. You could have stood your ground. The Seven of Wands. You may be very defensive towards this. You may be like, nah, I'm not with it. What's this Knight of Cups? It's, go it's happiness, Aries. Stop it. Stop the madness, Aries. S stop it. Come here. So I can pop you. <laughs> and then I'm going to hug you. Come here. Because this person is coming in with love towards you. 
th 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 I'm picking up on, on God is sending you a blessing, okay? The sun is the happiest card in tarot. This is a blessing coming in. This is someone coming in to bring you happiness, healing, love. This is fertility. This is abundance. This is new beginnings. This is new opportunity. Ooh, you could be getting pregnant. Somebody is coming in with their cup of love. They know it's going to be successful. This is a winner coming towards another winner. You could be very defensive. You could just not be with it. But I'm telling you, God is sending someone towards you. It's because you dropped the burdens. Ten of wands. What's the seven of wands about? Yeah, you could be in regret. The five of cups. Oh, somebody is sad because you're defensive towards them. You dropped somebody who was a burden. The Ten of Wands in the reverse. Oh, yeah. Somebody here, they could have got a ooh, they could have got a reading on you. Look at this devil card wanting to show itself. It could be someone toxic that could have got a reading done on you, Aries, and they found out that you got new love. Now they watching you. Ooh. Aries. It's a choice, Aries. What you gonna do? What you gonna do, Aries? Because you got true love coming in. You have somebody that's in a state of regret and sadness because they know they brought you burdens and you freed yourself. You blocked it, you dropped it, you let it go with the ten of wands. This is you taking it off your shoulders. This is this is you being free. God is bringing you an abundance of a plethora of blessings, of new opportunities. Okay, of abundance. This is the doors being unlocked for you with the Wheel of Fortune. This is a lot of opportunities, new networking opportunities of collaborating with different people coming towards you in regards to business, growth, okay? This is this is you. Ooh, this is favor. You have a blessing of love coming in. Ace of Cups, you have the blessing of love coming in. And there is someone that is so upset because they were doing this for a long period of time with this Seven of Pentacles, trying to put you in a, a state of drama, conflict, arguing, competition, riffraff, and you freed yourself. You saw the truth of it. Leo energy is here as well. You saw the truth of it. This could have been an earth sign or a fire sign doing this, and now they're they're upset. All they could do is hold their head down in shame, okay, because you're not with it. You're blocked. You're protected. You protect, you're protecting yourself. Your angels and your ancestors are guarding you and protecting you and are keeping you covered. They're also keeping this covered in regards to your success your riches, your wealth, this new opportunity, these new blessings coming in. One, two, three, as I'm saying this, get ready, Aries. It's your time to shine. I'm hearing, it's my time to shine. It's, it's your time to shine with the sun. It's your time to shine. Ooh, get ready for favor. I hope this helped you. If it did, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. I will be seeing y'all on the next video, and I'm sending y'all on a benefit of peace, love, and light, always.